what's going on youtubers Pumpy Man here uh, just doing another little video like I usually do um, just got back here to Indiana I know I've been off the scene for a while I've been down in Kentucky taking care of my sister um, she's actually up here with me in Indiana I came up here because here in a week or so I have a doctor's appointment so I came up to visit the family for a few weeks and then we're going right back down to Kentucky uh, to help take care of her but want to do a quick video while I'm here probably do a couple while I'm up here and uh, show you what I've been doing I've been waiting to do this for a while I've had the parts and stuff I just didn't take the time to do a complete video just because I've been so busy but I'll go ahead and show you some of the work I've done uh, as you know I like ARs and uh, what I did was I decided to upgrade one of my ARs here um, I know you've seen this one before this is my uh, Palmetto State Armory uh, lower I bought the strip lower and then built it up myself uh, Magpul furniture, uh, got the BCM gunfighter, nickel boron bolt pair group, um, premium upper uh, with the CFH barrel, Palmetto State Armory, it's the 5.56, and what I did was, it took me forever, but I went ahead and uh, I removed, as you can see, hope you can see that up there, I did do some uh, damage getting these off, but I took the front AT side off, and gas tube out and put a low profile because I'm going to be putting a different rail on this rifle <clears throat> just making it look better and uh, I went ahead and went with the Midwest Industries low profile, yeah, low profile gas block um, it's the .750 uh, diameter or whatever they, uh, they're they pretty cool I've got some of their equipment uh, this is a Midwest Industries brake on the end here uh, pretty good stuff. I actually won this. My dad actually won this and gave this to me uh, off a of YouTube giveaway. I was like a 50 or 60 dollar break for the end of it. And uh, pretty nice setup. It's not timed right now because I took it off because I had to take all this stuff off. Um, and their new system, you don't have, this is your barrel nut here. And it doesn't have any locking teeth on the outside or anything. Uh, you just slap this on and tighten it down to 40 foot pounds. And uh, what I did was tighten it down to 40 foot pounds, break it loose, tighten it to 40, break it loose, and third time, uh, put it about 45, honestly, and just left it set. And that's how you season the thread to get it on there. <clears throat> and since I had the A2 front sight, and it's got the longer sight base, it's got to cover both the rings there, um, the longer one. They told me that this longer one would look better, and it would cover up the, um, pretty much it would cover up the pin holes and stuff like that, and make it look better. But what I'm going to go with is the Midwest Industries uh, SS Series Free Float Gen 3. Just came out um, not too long ago. <clears throat> I'd say, I guess like a year or something it's been out, but uh, pretty good stuff. I have one of the Gen 2s, and it's pretty solid. I love it. I have small hands, um, and it fits great. Um, but I'm just doing a quick video and showing you all the stuff I did. It was kind of hard getting this, uh, this gas block on. I actually had to sand a little bit and drive it on with some uh, little bit of brute force but I got it on there I took it out today and shot it about 20 rounds and uh, it shot about perfect so anyway I didn't have any malfunctions I got everything lined up right I used the same uh, gas tube I had and uh, luckily on the first try I got it lined up perfect I've never done a low profile gas block and this one wasn't that hard I know a lot of guys have horror stories and say they don't work well uh, but Mine didn't turn out that bad at all. Uh, so anyway, I got this set, this set. I took it out today to sh shoot it to make sure it would uh, function properly before I went ahead and installed the rail. And uh, just so I wouldn't have to take it back off and do some working. But I'll go ahead and uh, end this video and show you guys the gas block here. And the next video you'll see me is uh, I'll have the rail installed. And yeah, do a little detail about that and everything. I uh, just wanted you guys to know my sister's doing all right. Uh, she still hurts quite a bit. Thank every one of you out in YouTube land for all your prayers and thoughts. Uh, you guys are awesome. And all you guys that still keep in contact with me, thank you so much. Uh, Bearded CB, Jason Williams, Jiu Jitsu 2000, you guys are awesome. Uh, and everybody else that reaches out, uh, thank you so much for being so kind to me and uh, watching my channel. But. I'm going to try to end this around 5 minutes and that's just what the latest project I've been doing 
uh, just messing around with some Midwest industry stuff. And uh, watch out for the next video and you'll see uh, the rail and stuff that I'm putting on this. So, anyway, that's it. Let me know what you guys think. Thanks.